This is part three of our video series that gives an overview of the Matomco product line and the various baits available. To view parts one and two, visit matomco.com and click on Learning Center for Farm and Home Owners. You'll find a link to all of our informational videos on the left side of the page. Or you can visit our YouTube channel by searching for Matomco USA. In this video, we'll talk about mole and gophers. Moles and gophers are different than other rodents like rats or mice. They have different behavior, anatomy, and diets. So you have to use something different than conventional rodent baits. Identifying the correct pest species is the first step in addressing your problem. Often people confuse moles and voles, but, but voles or meadow mice are much closer to a traditional house mouse. All of our mouse baits, tomcat, tomcat with bromethylene, hawk, or jaguar, can be used to kill meadow voles. If someone comes into a store with a mole problem, they really have two options, either a poison worm like Matomco mole killer or a trap. Moles don't eat grains like seeds, pellets, roots, or shoots. A mole will eat their body weight in earthworms every day. About 5% of their diet is made up of small grubs, and 2% is made up of incidental insects like centipedes, but 90 to 95% is earthworms. So they tunnel around underground looking for worms, which causes all sorts of damage to fields and yards. Our mole killer is packaged with 12 worms, which are food ingredients infused with the active ingredient bromethylene. You place these worms underground in an active runway, and one worm is enough to kill one mole. There are a few different mole traps around, but ours is really well made, heavy duty trap that can be reused again and again. We hear all the time from customers and professionals who have photos of multiple moles they've caught with this trap. Gophers are different than moles. They eat seeds, pellets, roots, shoots, rhizomes, that kind of thing. So we recommend Matomco Gopher Killer, which is a small pellet that you place into the ground. Once you find the gopher's burrow system, you dump a little bit down into the ground. Since zinc phosphide is an acute active ingredient, the gopher will die relatively quickly after eating the pellets. Thanks for watching part three of our video series reviewing the ways to control mole and gophers. If you'd like to view our other videos or need more information on any of our products, visit matomco.com.